strained until I started sweating like a pig, but I knew that this visit to the bathroom would be another unsuccessful one. I felt a stabbing pain in my stomach and a huge amount of pressure mounting up inside my intestines. Just when I thought that my piping was going to finally unclog, I was disappointed to find out that it was just gas. Nothing seemed to change in my bathroom routine. I started to get desperate and anxious. I could hear everybody outside talking to each other about the foul, putrid stench of the public bathroom stall I was in. But it felt impossible for me to get up. The pain was too sharp, and yet there was no poop coming out. You can't even begin to imagine the walk of shame I had to endure when I got out of there. Their eyes were fixated on me, and the murmurs on their lips only meant one thing for me. They were going to go home and tell everyone about how they had to wait for who knows how long, just because some guy couldn't even poop. I've had my fair share of embarrassing situations before. Gas leaks in public, noisy stomach, or even leaving important events because I felt the urge to go to the bathroom. But that topped all of them. I felt humiliated, and I just wanted the earth to swallow me whole. Never in a million years would I have imagined that my condition would be the first and most important step of a journey, at the end of which I would discover a 100% natural and dirt cheap method that would come to the aid of thousands of people that went through the same struggle as myself and help them recover from gut disease and reduce their stool time while also giving them flawless digestion. Just by performing a simple daily unclogging method which takes less than 20 seconds per day, Look, the following story isn't suited for the weak of heart. However, if you've been struggling with conditions such as IBS, GERD, anal fissures, or hemorrhoids, or if you want to get rid of the excess belly fat, reduce your cravings, and lower your blood sugar, or if you are awestruck by the fact that no matter how healthy you eat or how hydrated you stay during the days, you still experience gas, bloating sensations, or constipation and diarrhea then please bear with me until the end of this video because I'm going to show you why your digestive problems aren't something you can control with a so-called healthy diet. Your entire life you've been told to be careful with what you eat but for all the wrong reasons. You've been told that the wrong foods can affect your digestive system in ways that you wouldn't even want to find out about. But only part of that is true. The media and top pharmaceutical companies want to keep you out of the loop when it comes to the real reasons behind your gut issues. The researchers at the National Center for Biotechnology Information have repeatedly shown that if you have digestive problems, your body has most likely been affected by this multicellular organism.